In Lebanon, 50,000 people are expected to march towards the border with occupied Palestinian territories on Sunday. Now that move is aimed at marking the 63rd anniversary of the Nakba, or Catastrophe Day, which marks the establishment of the Israeli regime in 1948. The demonstrators are to gather in Ben Jabal village of Maroon al-Ras, where intense fighting broke out between Israeli forces and Hezbollah fighters during the 2006 summer war. The marchers are expected to start from Bekaa, the southern cities of Sidon, and Tyre, and refugee camps located in northern Lebanon. Thousands of Israeli troops are on high alert across the occupied land due to protests in the run-up to Sunday's commemoration of the Nakba. And on the anniversary of the Nakba or Catastrophe Day, members of different Palestinian groups told us about the aspirations and demands of Palestinians. The Nakba Day anniversary comes this year amid big developments in the region and amid changes and conspiracy on the Palestinian cause through American-Israeli vision to restrict the Palestinian people and their rights. On the occasion of the Nakba Day, we remember the destruction of hundreds of Palestinian towns and villages in addition to deporting hundreds of thousands from their own land. The Palestinian refugees stress their right to return. On the 63rd anniversary of the Catastrophe Day, when Zionism committed one of its ugliest crimes, we have a message to the world. The Palestinian people who lived for thousands of years on their motherland will not give up even an iota of their land. The Palestinian people will continue their struggle and resistance until all their territories are liberated and they've achieved the right of return.